Good morning, ma'am. I am Nurse Ange. I will be your nurse for the day, and I will be performing a functional assessment. But before we proceed, can I please ask for your full name and your birth date? I am Shaina Saliden, and my birth date is February 9, 2001. Okay, thank you so much for that. Okay, ma'am. I am going to take your vital signs to assess your condition, epithet changes, and abnormalities in your condition. Let's start taking your temperature, followed by your blood pressure, respiratory rate, and your pulse rate. Okay, ma'am, so let us now proceed to the functional assessment. And first will be the circulatory functional assessment. Um, ma'am Shaina, do you have any history of angina, heart failure, or any cardiac disease? Nothing before. Have you currently experienced any chest pain or chest discomfort, especially during exertion? Have you been diagnosed of any cardiac disease or have you been taking medications? If there are any medications, can you please take it? Thank you. Are there any sources of stress which triggers the situation? Since you mentioned earlier that um, you don't have any uh, medications, I'm going to not make it clear that you're not taking any medications regularly. Have you undergone any diagnostic exams like ECG, GAT test, stress test, etc.? No. Since you mentioned earlier that you were not diagnosed with any diseases and you're not taking any medications, I'm gonna not take it here that you're not taking any medications regularly, right? Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, now, so let's proceed to the respiratory function. So, you're not taking any medications. Miss Shane, do you smoke? No. Okay. Do you have any difficulties in breathing? What do you feel? Not. Can you still complete your task like exercising? Or have you experienced any decrease in energy while doing this task? No. Do you frequently cough? Is there any presence of sputum? Nothing. Have you undergone any diagnostic exams like x-ray, sputum analysis, etc.? No. Okay, next will be the gastrointestinal function. Are there any changes in your usual diet or appetite? No. Are there any occurrences of nausea or any stomach discomfort? Have you experienced having constipation or diarrhea? No. Have you experienced any unusual bleeding or discharges or any urinary discomfort by having difficulty in urination? No. 
have you experienced any neurologic dysfunctions like tremors, seizures, etc.? Have you experienced any speech difficulty, problems in expressing, memory, orientation, balance, sensation, or other motor function? No. Do you have any sleep disturbances? No. For the musculoskeletal function, do you experience stiffness of the joints? No. Miss Shaina, can you please stand up? Okay, thank you, Pop. Miss Shaina, can you please take a few steps and go back to your seat? Do you experience difficulty in vision and hearing? Um, when I get vision, I have a blurred vision and my visual acuity is 150 in the left and 150 also in the right. Okay, thank you so much for that. Okay, next will be the integumentary function. Do you experience any dryness and itching? For the integrate and metabolic function, are there any family history of diabetes? Yes. Have you experienced any change in weight and appetite? No. How often do you experience fatigue? Not so far. Do you experience increased thirst? No. Okay, Ms. Shaina, since you mentioned earlier that you have a visual activity of 150, for both of your left and right eyes. So, may I ask, when did it start? Um, 2019. 2019, yes. And you started wearing glass when? Um, June 29. June 29, awesome. Thank you. Have you experienced any slow wound healing? No. How often do you have headache? Only if I'm stressed. Okay, thank you. Do you have any stomach discomfort? Alright, so thank you so much for that, Misha. Now we end up here, and thank you so much for your cooperation.